The manufacture of fiberglass parts for the recreational boating market has seen many changes over its 50 plus year history, but none has improved the quality and durability of boats more than resin infusion. This video demonstrates this process, which is used today to build the fiberglass components for both the saber and back cove ranges of boats. Just as in a hand layup process, the gel coat or exterior color is sprayed into the mold first. Following the gel coat, a vinyl ester skin coat is applied, then all layers of fiberglass and coring materials are loaded into the mold dry and are temporarily held together by adhesives. The makeup of the laminate varies from section to section depending on the structural requirement in that area. Technicians trained in composite technology lay in pattern cut fiberglass cloth known as e-glass, the weights and structural requirements of which have been determined by our engineers. Corsau coring is used in our hulls to create greater section without adding weight, important because lighter boats are faster and more fuel efficient. Once all structural materials are loaded, the crew pulls a plastic sheet over the entire assembly and seals the sheet around the perimeter of the mold. Now resin distribution lines and vacuum lines are placed strategically in the mold. After several days of setup, the crew is ready for the actual infusion to take place. Resin lines are opened up and vacuum lines are turned on. A typical hull or large deck part will take about 90 minutes to infuse. The crew monitors the process to ensure that the fiberglass resin flows to all areas of the mold. As the resin approaches the edges of the part, the resin supply is cut off while the vacuum pressure continues to pull air and excess resin out of the bag until all excess resin has been removed and all fiberglass materials are fully wetted out. The laminate remains under vacuum until it is fully cured to ensure the part is free of voids. Parts made with this process have an optimum glass to resin ratio for ultimate strength and durability. An additional benefit to this process is that our associates and the environment in which we all live are exposed to fewer volatile organic compounds and our clients benefit too with a better fuel economy and performance. At Sabre and Back Cove Yachts, we are proud of the yachts that we build and the process we use to deliver the best possible designs and performance for our owners.